What's up everybody, it's Ipsimon Chibi and today I'm going to be unboxing Castlevania Anniversary Collection for the PS4. So let's get into this. So, this is the font. Dracula, you can sign in Belmont, the castle, wonderful, really cool. And the back shows the games that comes in this collection. Let me try to, there we go. So, boom, do, and do. I have that one on NES, but the other ones, I was like, yo, Wow, I believe this one you would need an actual uh, Famicom, so I don't have that, so yeah. Uh, I think it's pretty cool. Oh, also, I, what was it? This one, Kid Dracula is the Game Boy one, I believe. But yeah, as you can see, these are the games. Really, really wonderful. Now, one thing I can say is, this is limited one games. Me, I heard about them all these years, and I was, I'll just be straight up, I, I was lied to. Because, long story short, as I open this up, I hold Limited Run Games is basically just the name, you know, Limited Run Games, you know, it's like common games, this and that. But nah, man, these games are fucking ex like, not expensive as in like $200, you know what I mean? Well, some goes for that, I was researching really deep. And, long story short, I'm not a fan of Limited Run Games. I get this because, you know, you get a lot of things... I hate, in fact, I hate limited run games due to it being limited run, which makes it really hard for fans of, say, Castlevania to go out and find it. And then it's like, oh, yo, someone's a reseller trying to sell it for 80 bucks. Thankfully, I paid 60. Brand new game. Well, 60, or was it like with tax? Probably 65, you know. But yeah, oh, oh, a manual? Whoa, okay, that that we need to see. <laughs> Yo, okay, first is the disc. Really wonderful, really cool, the castle and all of that. Oh, yo. Ooh, we gonna... This is after, wait a minute. I, I did not know this came with a manual. Maybe that's why it's expensive, because they have manuals. Look at that art. Wait a minute. Um, yeah, there we go. You have a skeleton, you have the villains, and then you have Simon right there, looking amazing. Some kaiju looks like, <laughs> like a hey, Yo, this is amazing. Oh, man. Maybe this is like a limited one games thing, you know, have like the art in the back case. Let me know in the comments if you're like a huge fan of limited one games. I'm not, I, like I said, I don't purchase from them, you know, I'm not a fan, let's say, due to it being limited one. To be honest, I thought that was just the name like other people said, but no. This is the manual. Really cool. Or oh, is this like a post? Oh no, this is a manual. <laughs> yeah, that, imagine if it's like a post that like, whoosh. you know, back in the day you get postals to put in your wall. Yo, this is pretty cool. Now, I have a prediction. Maybe this is, you know, the actual thing. Like I said, I'm new to limited one games. You know what I mean? Is it expensive because it's also coming with a manual, a physical thing, so they're charging more for the paper. Because if so, I mean, that's what shit, you know, PS3 wasn't like that. So, yeah, pretty much that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Until next time.